Hi, my name is Catherine, and today I will give you a quick overview of the form builder in PandaForm. So let's say I would create a PandaForm support system by changing the form title. As you can see, I can see a variety of fields to add to the form. I would choose a single line field for nickname, which I can make a required field. I'll also put an email field, which I will also make required. PandaForm will help me validate this field. I can also add paragraph text. Let's name this, what is the problem? As you can see, I can also change the field size. You can also put a file field. You can do some simple layout, such as adding the PandaForm logo for branding. You just retrieve the URL of the image and put it in the image address box and drag and drop to where you want it. I can also make two fields in the same line by putting two columns in the CSS class on both fields. Once this is done, on the published form, these two lines will show up as one line. Another thing I can do is make a field type. Let's say in this form I want to know what kind of incident it was, so let's use the radio button and name it type of incident, whether it is a bug or a question. But I have a problem. All of these fields are visible for those who submit the form. But for this field, I only want people with login access, which means my support team, to read it. To mark this field as a private field, I can mark it as a restricted field. Now only my support team will see this field. You can change a variety of settings in the Settings tab. But for now, let's just go to Publish. Once the URL is generated, you can see that the form is nicely created once you put it in the address box. PandaForm is very simple and this is an overview of how the form builder works.